I want to uh, mention here a second that uh, I'm in one of the new summer blockbusters. I'm ah. in, yeah, I'm in the uh, Robert Redford uh, Horse Whisperer. You're in Horse yeah. Whisperer? Yeah. And if, if we can just take a second here, I want to uh, share this with you folks. If you haven't already seen it, here's a clip of me now in the Horse Whisperer. Take a look. Yeah, I got a message you called. Hello, Robert Redford? <laughs> this is me, Dave. My friends said that your movie, The Horse Whisperer, is three hours long, and it, it makes it hard to sit through. Oh, they said that, huh? Mr. Redford, would you whisper something to my doggy? H hang on a minute. It's Robert Redford. He's going to whisper to you. So goodbye now. <laughs> so I'm in the horse whisperer. Yeah, yeah I'm in the big that. blockbuster. Yeah, I'm very That's excited marvelous. about it. That's marvelous. You know, uh, Dave. Yeah. What? Hey. Huh? As long as. As long as we're plugging summer movies and right. all, you know, I, I, know. I am in a summer sure movie. Sure you are. Go ahead, Paul. Yes, what do you got? It's my own movie that I star in, and it's a gritty urban police drama called Egg Cop. Egg Cop. Yeah, I Egg have Cop. a clip. Let's okay, roll clip. it. Here's Paul. Police, open up! That's for killing my partner, you dirtbags! Wow, man, I'm telling you. That's, uh, it's, got, it's got hit written all over it. Thank you. <clears throat> now, uh, here's something that may be a little surprising. The rats here in the Ed Sullivan Theater got together and uh, wrote and uh, directed and filmed their own uh, movie. And we're going to show you a clip. It's the rats here in the Ed Sullivan Theater. And I'll just, I've seen it, and uh, it may not be your cup of tea. It's a little, uh, I don't know, it's a little avant-garde. Really? You know what I'm saying? It's a little, a little esoteric, perhaps. But nonetheless, here it is. Uh, not a bad first effort for the rats in the Ed Sullivan Theater. <laughs> there, make sure. Kind of makes you think, doesn't it? Kind of makes you think a little bit there. Anybody else uh, have a clip they'd like to show? A new summer movie? Yeah, uh, I do, Dave. Anton Zip, ladies and yeah. gentlemen, our drummer for the last 45 years. Anton Zip. Yeah. Uh, Dave, I, I have a clip from my big summer movie called Dusty Spurs. Dusty Spurs. Oh, it's a Western. Sounds like a Western, huh? Yeah, exactly. It is a Western. Oh, okay. Roll it. All right, here we go. Anton. Is that Dusty Spurs? Thanks a lot, man. Yeah, Thank keep you. the change. Thanks. Bye. Rupert G., the uh, man who operates the Hello Deli out there on 53rd Street, has his own summer movie. Rupert, are you there? Can you hear me? Yes, Dave. Okay, tell us about your movie, Rupert. Well, Dave, it's a, it's a thriller set against a sexually charged backdrop of a delicatessen. Wow. All right, let's take a look here. Can I help you? I understand you're a man who knows how to slice his meat. Oh, uh, yes, I make sandwiches. Wow. Why don't you whip me up something big and thick? Okay. <laughs> this summer, get ready to feast on Rupert G in Sex Club Sandwich. <laughs> Seems a little, uh, uh, is that, that's like pornographic there, Rupert, isn't that what that is? It's an erotic thriller, Dave. Uh-huh. <laughs> Seems like it's pornographic. No, Dave, it's an erotic thriller. Uh -huh. I don't work, Blue. Okay, great. Thanks, Rupert. Uh, let's see, before we uh, wrap this up, anybody else have a uh, clip they would like to show us? Anybody else? Uh, here? Let's show Tony. Go ahead and set us up for us, uh, Tony. Well, it's a scene from the disaster movie Gale Force. I play a blind seamstress 
shipwrecked on an uninhabited desert island. All right, let's take a look at the scene from Gale Force. Hello? Anyone here? Tony, Tony Randall. Thank you, Dave. Thank you for coming back up.